eight year old is recovering in the hospital after she got grazed by a stray bullet in North Harris County. ABC 13's Charlie Edsey joins us now live with some new information from investigators about where the gunfire may have come from. Charlie. Yeah, good morning to you, Brianna. Well, this little girl was just within a few inches from getting seriously hurt. She was at an exercise class at the time, and her mom also was inside the building as well. And it all happened here at this building on the north side, the Flex Training Facility right off of Imperial, ba Imperial Valley. And this girl was grazed by the bullet on her shoulder. Now, HCSO deputies were on the scene last night just before 10 p.m. after the shooting happened. This is the information that they sh they've shared with ABC 13. The little girl and five adults, again, including her mom, were inside the building and a door was left open. That is how investigators think the little girl was grazed by the bullet, and they think that bullet was fired from a handgun. They believe the bullet went through that open door and right in the little girl's direction. It appears uh, a stray bullet entered the building and struck an eight-year-old uh, little girl in the back. Um, it appears to be a, a graze only. And again, we know that she was struck in her shoulder and thankfully the little girl is going to be OK. She was taken to the hospital and investigators are now thinking that the bullet may have been fired from a gun uh, from somebody who was on the nearby street here. And so the investigation continues to find that shooter. And last night they were combing the area to try and find some shell casings that can glean more information. But of course, if you have any information, you're urged to contact HCSO. We're live from the north side this morning. Charlie at City, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. Charlie. Thank you. This is the third child hit by a stray bullet in our area since Christmas Eve. Mind you, that was just the other day. On Sunday morning, an 11 year old was shot while asleep in her bed in Livingston. Polk County deputies say they want to speak with somebody named Avery Norman, who may be driving a black Dodge truck or black Acura about that shooting on FM 1988. On Christmas Eve, a five year old was shot when a neighbor's gun accidentally went off on Barker Cypress. Neither child was seriously hurt.